I'd like to make a small announcement. Uh, this is supposed to be a launch of an initiative uh, that's being executed by, by organizations across North America. So as you know, uh, we've all been impacted through COVID in the world. It's a world crisis. And even more so, we have an, a major impact in our homeland, Goa. Uh, and uh, there are families that have been impacted, villages, as a result of COVID. Uh, and what we have done is a group of organizations have come together to actually launch a North America all worldwide fr uh, fundraiser. So we have reached out to organizations across the globe as well to join us. And I'd like to do a small presentation just to show you uh, the, the magnitude of the work that's happening and also credits to all the associations uh, uh, and individuals such as Effie and Carmeline who have helped uh, to get us to this point. Um, so what I'd like to do is I'd like to present uh, a small, I'm hoping you can see this. So this is the flyer and what it is is, is uh, showcasing the, uh, the help that's required across 172 villages that are currently impacted uh, right from health, medical supplies, food, employment and education support uh, during the pandemic. So uh, every organization across the US, so you can see the magnitude of associations that have got together across US and Canada. And this is historical for me in recent times that I have ever seen where organizations have come together to work together towards a common cause. Uh, so folks, we are looking at you for helping out or supporting this fundraising campaign. So GOA Toronto has their own campaign. You have Quebec Gone Association, GOA Vancouver, GOA Association Calgary, uh, who are helping out in partnership with uh, the GCO, the Go and Charitable Organization, who will issue tax receipts uh, for, for your donations. Um, in the US, we have the same. We have all the associations across the US, and we have Kwas Sudarup, who's also helping uh, as a, as a uh, donation facilitator and, and providing tax receipts for the US citizens. So um, again, this is a noble cause. Uh, so looking forward and appeal to you, all of you, uh, pretty much it's a call to action for our community to help Goa in these times of needs, uh, in this time of need. Uh, so here, here is a bit of a cause of the vision and mission in terms of uh, what we're doing. Uh, obviously, uh, there are you know, uh, families and individuals impacted, and we're working in sol solidarity as a, in a Goan community to help those impacted. Uh, some of us are fortunate not to be as impacted financially as others, and this is a time for us to step up as a community and move the needle to help those in need. Um, as you know, we have recently did a food bank launch, uh, campaign here in Toronto, and we raised about 56,000 meals uh, during, uh, during the uh, COVID period. Um, and going back to uh, the areas that we are assisting is around health, medical supplies, family assistance, employment, and education. Uh, so uh, we have two partners right now and are working with other secular FCRA compliant partners that are being identified as we speak. Uh, so the current partners are the provincial Jesuits and St. Vincent de Paul uh, in Goa who are assisting various parishes and churches, uh, uh, villages across Goa. So here's the list of all the villages and I'm sure your village is here so you could contribute towards this cause and help, help these, all these villages that require help uh, in, in, in Goa. The list of participating organizations, as you know, uh, we have the U.S. organizations, we have uh, the Canadian organizations, and we also reached out to you across Australia and uh, U.S. as well, uh, U.K. as well to join us, and hopefully, and, and the Middle East, so hopefully we can create a much more bigger impact with all of us working to, together towards this cause. So again, this is just to, uh, you know, just to show you that how serious we are, and there's a proper structure and governance to ensure that the right people get the right money and it reaches the, the impacted people. So there is, uh, everybody's doing this on a voluntary basis. There's no administration fees. This money plans to go, is planned to go straight to the pockets of those impacted uh, to help them out uh, in the various categories mentioned. Uh, so folks, uh, looking for you to uh, for your donations and help. Uh, you can go to goatoronto.com and, and donate from there as well. Uh, and every organization is going to have their own uh, campaign. So. If you are in that neighborhood and you know the organization that represents uh, the community, please reach out to them uh, to help towards this cause. And once again, and thank you, and let's work together towards this noble cause. Thank you very much.